Hello everyone, I hope you're having a good day today. We're going to be in Life of Fred Butterflies. If you have a Butterflies book, go ahead and get your book out now. Remember, you can press pause at any time during this video. We're going to be on page 115, chapter 18, and the title is Letters from Brothers. Fred wanted to play. He took off his hat and put a sticky note on it that read, to Fred Gauss, room 314, math building. Then he put it in the mailbox. The light on top of the box went on. Then he ran like crazy down the hallway to his office. In the language of running, he sprinted. He opened his office door and on his desk was, campus mail at Kittens University is fast. Fred took off his earmuffs, boots, coat, scarf, mittens, pants, and shirt. In his pajamas, he felt just right. Not too hot and not too cold. Kingy was busy reading five letters that he had received from Kenneth, Kendrick, Carney, Kermit, and Corey. Here is Kenneth's letter. Kenneth, Kendrick, Carney, Kermit, and Corey all knew that you should always thank someone for gifts they give to you. When Fred read to Kingy, Kingy always remembered to thank Fred. If someone is reading this book to you, give them a kiss, a hug, or shake their hand and tell them thank you. Fred wanted to play with Kingy before they headed to bed. Fred suggested they play tea party. One of them could pretend to pour the tea and ask how many lumps of sugar the other one wanted. Kingy shook his head. He said he wanted real American food. He wanted pizza. American food? Fred asked. That's silly, Fred explained. Number one, 500 years before Christ, the soldiers of King Darius baked bread on their shields and added cheese and dates. Number two, in the hundred years before Christ, Virgil wrote one of the world's most famous poems, the Aeneid. One line reads, see, we devour the plates on which we fed. Those plates were made of flour. Number three, in 997 AD, pizza appeared in medieval Latin. Number four, people who came from Italy in the late 1800s were the first to introduce pizza to the United States. So Fred continued, it would be silly to call it an American food. Kingy was convinced, but he still wanted pizza. Fred grabbed a whole bunch of nickels he had in his desk and headed down the hallway to the vending machines. The small pizza was a dollar, which is a hundred cents. Fred put in his nickels and counted by fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Out popped a hot pizza. It was too hot for him to carry in his bare hands. He noticed that the campus mailbox was right next to the pizza vending machine. His finger, he wrote in the melted cheese, room 314, and then slid the pizza into the mailbox. The light on the top of the box went on. Fred sprinted back to his office. Okay, are you ready for your turn to play? Remember, you can press pause at any time. Go ahead and grab a sheet of paper and a pencil, and let's begin. Number one, count by fives from 120 to 160. It will begin with 120, 125, 130, 135. Number two, it was getting late. What time was it? Number three, what is the next number after 60? Number four, what is the next number after four million? Number five, how many feet are there in a yard? Hint, it is one smaller than four. Fred is one yard tall. Number six, 
What is the ordinal number that comes right after seventh? Number seven. What is the cardinal number that comes right after 82? Okay, here are your answers. Go ahead and check your word. Now, are you ready for today's homeschooling meme? Here you go. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that one. Join me here tomorrow for chapter 19. Bye.